Some of the nation's brightest young minds were in Houston Monday competing against each other in the name of science. 19 students making up five teams from across the country appeared on stage for the National UV the Chemist Challenge in Memorial City. Celebrating the theme of states of matter in space, the Chemical Educational Foundation said it could think of no better city to play host than Houston, home of NASA's Johnson Space Center. Students competed for scholarships that will help them go on to pursue chemistry and STEM-related fields. ABC 13 Houston was proud to serve as official news sponsor of the challenge. You know, you, you sit and think these are only eighth graders, and it feels as though you're having a lecture from a college professor that knows this, the science so in-depth. And to understand and think about and hear them give practical examples of how they can apply what they've learned in real life uh, was really exciting. 70% of the jobs that are going to be available by the time they graduate college don't even exist today. And they all kind of will fall within that field of science, technology, engineering, and math. So it's not only too important to push that, but also to prove that anyone can do it. When we look at the next generation, of students that are going to become, you know, our economy in 2030, 2040 to keep us competitive. We just are not generating enough diverse STEM educated uh, people. So like in our company, we look for people that are qualified to fill the roles that we have. 23% of the workforce in a general population needs to be technically qualified and we're just not generating enough. So for us, we start at the root of the problem and really introducing chemistry at the grade school level really helps inspire a passion for that.